I'm Sharon Hayden, I'm Artistic Director of Dorchester Arts. We're part of the West Dorset Collaboration Group and I'm going to talk to you about programming. There are two things that um, have had an impact on me and one is personally and the other is professionally in terms of the programme. So personally, for me, I'm a person that likes to work in a group. I'm the only arts professional in my organisation, so that's quite difficult for me. I get a lot of um, inspiration, aspirations from other professionals. So coming together with the Marine Theatre and Bridport Arts Centre allows me to be involved in a more professional level. So that's good for me personally. And also, there's a lot of trust in our group and the reason why there's a lot of trust is because all three of us are members of an action learning group so we've already got an underlying trust connection together so we can be very honest about what would fit in our program what we don't think is very good whether our experience with a company was good or bad so that cuts out a lot of um, things in terms of dealing with our relationship with the companies, if Bridport Arts Centre have had a very good experience, I could then go and say to them, I've heard you've had a good experience at Bridport, we'd like to bring you to Dorchester. So that makes our, our relationship with companies much more professional, I think. So then on a professional level, in terms of programming for Dorchester Arts, I'm the artistic director. That means I have a lot of jobs to do and programming is one of those jobs. I don't have the time to spend researching, looking at companies and going and seeing companies as much as say Margie has. She's the programmer at Bridport Arts Centre and that's her sole purpose. So she brings a lot of things to the table that I wouldn't be able to, to see. For example, a few weeks ago she went to Decibel and she brought back about 20 things that she thought was really good and with her recommendation I could choose and we've got two or three that we're going to put into the spring programme. So that's brilliant. So for me it's all very positive and I don't know why we weren't doing it. A few things just to highlight that I didn't say before. One is that we need to start producing a shared diary of events. I think across DLA it would be really good. It's a very simple thing to do and we don't do it. And then the other thing that we had a long while ago was an agreement that members of Dorchester Arts Centre would get a discount at Bridport Arts Centre. That doesn't exist anymore that we, we should introduce a joint membership well maybe not a joint membership that may be going a step too far but maybe that's where we're working what we're working towards